Dan, after getting a tip from an anonymous viewer here in Limestone County, I did some research and I learned that, that Wyatt wasn't just a pastor, but a co-founder of this online ministry. The message I received from a viewer told me Paul Wyant used to be a preacher with the United New Testament Church International Ministry Association. I reached out to the association and showed up at the current pastor's door to ask him about Paul Wyant. He confirmed to me that Wyant and his wife co-founded the ministry in 1999 and Wyant served as a pastor until he resigned in 2016. The current pastor didn't want to go on camera, but he told me he was shocked and couldn't believe the news. He also told me Wyant hasn't been a member in good standing since he resigned, meaning he wasn't actively participating with the ministry, but the pastor told me as far as he knows, Wyant's resignation had nothing to do with the recent criminal charges, saying he and his wife had simply decided to change professions. United New Testament Church is an online ministry. There is no physical location, but I found videos of Wyant online where he appears to be preaching. Wyant is now facing charges after investigators say he sexually abused several children. Investigators tell me the incidents happened more than 10 years ago and the victims knew Wyant. Now I reached out to, to 20 people here on Facebook about the arrest, those people being members of the ministry and former co-workers of Wyant's, but I still haven't heard back from them. Reporting live in Limestone County, Scotty Kay, Way 31 News.